Hello and welcome to the Meek Informant. I'm Eric. And, and I'm Nick. And we got Nick. We got to work on how to make that streamlined one day. Look, I tried. I tried. I <laughs> you, thought you left me like enough of a gap there that I was just going to jump right in. I did. It's my fault. Um, hey, we're back after a quite the hiatus. Going to try and get this YouTube channel kicking and hopping again. And yeah, yeah. we're going to do, we're going to start that up with some deck, deck doctoring videos. This is attempt two. We just experienced uh, an internet crash on my end during the most glorious turn one of this deck that could possibly ever exist so it, it was going to be so good we've seen the high side um oh well that's my there we're streaming oh no god i'm so unprofessional <laughs> how do you do this anymore <laughs> so anyway we're gonna um <clears throat> play this deck which won't have as good of a performance so we've seen the good now we'll see the bad um Yep. Yeah, now you're going to draw absolutely nothing. Yeah, very briefly, uh, we're going to play a game here where I, I'm going to pilot and Nick is going to watch over my shoulder, give commentary, and then we're going to doctor up the deck and see if there's any changes we want to make. The deck is authored by Brandon W. Lane. Uh, he's calling it YNS Swarm Murder. It is fun. It, uh, f -f 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 it centers on those who serve and for greater glory so get lots of people out for cheap and then keep them around for a turn and you have lots of money and you can just swarm all of the people um lots of low cost characters obstinance uh, so the two costers up to here or below two and then samurai oh yeah that too one unicorn at three cost and then lions pride brawler agatoki and honor general couple staging grounds and it's um unicorn splash for challenge on the fields and some ambushers strength in numbers to send people home as well and one glorious victory and uh worth noting there's uh it's a uh, seeker of water yes it is seeker of water for uh midnight revels and art of war yeah i mean i know technically that's the reason but okay okay that's that's how you feel fine uh so let's see if we can get an opponent um is there any open no no open games so let's do this <clears throat> and queue up the hey Oop. uh the in format you nah, my my mouse keeps doing that. Uh, just gonna copy that. Okay. And this is the part we cut out. Eh. Or not. <laughs> that's that's too much work. <clears throat> the part where you showed like your Discord and yeah. No, oh. <clears throat> no, that's too real. That's uh, true. That's true. Got to keep the uh, the true feeling. Uh, we can we can give it a. Oh, no, it's, it's so much better to have a, a live opponent and you looking over instead of playing against you because then they can't talk about it. You left. You left. I'm I'm going to see if I can recruit people from the the lobby. <laughs> I don't think so. Nobody hangs out in the lobby. Why would they? Anybody looking to play? Oh, you know what? Let's do. Let's do what? Let's hit up the NEL 5R folks. Oh, yes. Um, so I guess while that's going on, just one more peek at the deck. Um, tactical Ingenuity. Uh, so I played this for the first time this past Tuesday with just a single game, but it was a lot of fun. But I, one thing I hadn't realized was this card i've never played lion really ever before uh, but this card only being able to attach to a commander character was something that i wasn't really aware of before so targets for that would be the honor general agatoki not the brawler not the samurai not go he go hey ikoma tsunari Give the tactician. Go, go high. Go high. high. It should be go high, right? Because it's. All right. 
Is so it go Han high. Is it Han I can. Oh, no, no, don't. No, don't ask me that. This is real good. All right. Mike's on his way to save us. Oh, yay. All right, everyone. Thanks for sticking sticking with us. Um, so I'm going to be mulling hard for those who serve and for greater glories. I want one of each. And we got it last time, so it's probably going to happen, right? Right. Yeah. I It definitely happens twice in a row. <laughs> if it does, then it proves it's consistent, I think. <laughs> yep. Yep. That's how you'll know. That's how probability works. Yeah. Yeah. As if it happens twice, it happens every time. It will have a hundred percent success rate. Oh boy. This is this is a lull. Oh there we go. There we are. All right. Hooray. <laughs> is he gonna play, play lion? Probably. It's gonna be great. Lion versus lion. Lion mirror. Um, I guess I will go first. You definitely you definitely go first. Look at this. Seeker Void Lion. <laughs> YNS versus YNS. Versus Yori Ojin no Shiro. It's nice. Great. Uh, so again, pilgrimage on box. Yeah. yeah, I think that's fine. We want Midnight Rebels to get hit. Do some work. Yeah. Although I bet he is playing a crazy, like I bet you're just gonna end up with like exactly the same turn one. Yes, I'm getting all getting rid of all this. Although, tactician. Yeah. Pitch him. I want him. Yeah. Pitch him. Yeah. All right. Favorable berserker brawler obstinate. That's okay. We got a greater glory. glory. All right. Pitch the rest. Damn. We still could get it. Cool. You still. Yeah. Well, the five bid. You, you're not going to get it on. You're not going to get uh, those who serve in time. But that's okay. Yeah, he's playing the same deck. <laughs> yep. Uh, no, he's not actually. This one. Well probably a swarmy deck but i mean he's got courtiers in it and stuff uh right so playing cards um we don't have a thing we'll do the obstinate he can he can bid us yeah he's not gonna yeah okay <laughs> so he's doing our decks thing all right um he's doing it weirder should i should i get a brawler then and kind of do the opposite well so <clears throat> yeah you, you at least get the brawler to make him have the ready for battle. So this in two fate. Yeah. And then and then pass. No. No, Matsu. By the berserk. Oh yeah, because he's gonna play more than one, right? All in attack. Yeah. And for greater. Yeah, I mean you're you're basically getting passing fate. He's pay, he's playing all that. I stuff. I know I'm right. I know I'm gonna get that. So. I've got the dragon background. Okay, so he one faded a prodigy. Okay, we're gonna no fade oh, this. He killed your obstinate recruit with it. <laughs> uh, cool. <laughs> that's funny. Well, it didn't cost me anything, so. Yeah, that's that's fair. It won't even cost me passing fate. It's true. Yeah. Staging ground. Yeah, I should have thought of that. Okay. Oh, he gets a two fate. Uh, two fate what? LPB. Well, he's probably not going to play the LPB though, right? No, he, he can't. No, he he he's done. He so honor bids here. I'm five. Yeah, I don't care. Yeah. There's no way he does. There it is. All right. So next turn. Yeah, next turn. But I can for great for greater glory now. Although that's not as good. Yeah, but <clears throat> you've got two of those who serves, so you've so, got plenty of time to draw into your next one. I want the fine katana on Lion's Pride, right? Yeah. Throw them both on there. Two, yeah. Yep. Odds he's running any attachment control that can hit you in, uh, hit your characters are pretty low. All right, so do I, Prepare for war. do I go both in? Yeah. Okay. If you need to, if you hit something like bad, you oh. can always back out with the first fit, with the uh, favorable favorable ones. right all right uh well, let's see For earth rings always good yep uh, void would be helpful here <clears throat> for this one yeah. but yeah or water but okay uh or oh wait i have to actually <laughs> yep yeah you can't skip straight to fine mill 
Brawler or st staging ground? Yeah, you want to kill that. <clears throat> Art of War. We hit? Art of War. Okay, he'll probably just let this break. Oh, he's going to do a token defense. Okay. Why? I don't know. Either that or you're about to get hit with like a try again tomorrow or something. No, oh, yeah, this is a courtier for like for shame. He's a big for shame guy, I think. Is he? <clears throat> I don't know. Oh, oh. He's in the tank now. Oh, he. It... Yeah, I didn't want to. That's fine. Okay. That's what I want anyway. This makes sense. So he has. So who do I bow? Two fate. Uh, so this... Go ahead now. No, Sonuri is plus one, plus one to all his people. <clears throat> right. But Gohei doesn't bow. Okay. Uh, well, actually, hold on. She's is, Does she add plus one, plus one to everyone, or just... If it's three or more. Yeah. So she's plus three, plus three. He's... Hmm. Well, if I bow this one, then he can only have two others. So this one won't get the plus one. Oh, that's true. It has to be three Bushi, right? Yeah, so let's do this. Yep. Okay. For sure. Oh my god, he didn't have the uh, ready for battle. No, well, not yet. Oh no, it has to, it's a reaction, right? Yeah, it's a reaction. <clears throat> Alright, so pass. Okay. Uh, Art of Warring. He's a seeker, yes, we'll get rid of it. He didn't <clears throat> do I do this? Definitely. <clears throat> Feels, yeah, okay. That's uh, fine. It's it's not huge, insane, absurd value, but it's not terrible. Okay. I oh, got... Man, you got one of his those who serves. Hmm. So he's got one left. Yep. Okay. Then I got a break. That's fine. I could have actually pulled the Berserker out. That was dumb. Or the... Then it wouldn't have uh, gained the fate. That's true. Okay. So we pass. And if you pull out the smaller, <clears throat> then you're not breaking. You would have had to play cards. Yeah, the brawler, right? Yeah, the that was the strength. So, yeah. My art of war. I will get a fate. Oh, water ring. Yeah, that is an option, huh? <laughs> yes. Uh, no defense. Oops, what? Well, no, he's just going to stand uh, go hey. Oh, with water. Yeah. Um. After I lose a mill, yeah. Nothing to be done here, right? No. Yeah, I don't think so, right? So he's just gonna... To he, might, he might break. decide to break. He, he could, like, throw a fan here. Regal bearing. Oh, all right. Uh, yep, so he's gonna draw a bunch of cards. Yeah, he is drawing all the cards. Um, okay, so that's why the Prodigy's in there. Wait, what? Draw zero cards? No, it it always says zero. Okay. It's he he draws four. Yeah, thirteen to seven. Yeah. Okay. So we pass. There we go. Okay, he is gonna break. It's not bad. I wanted it to break, right? So. Yeah. Uh, I cool. Mean, you do and you don't, right? I mean, because he's gonna get two breaks <laughs> year one, which isn't amazing. There. There's my winnings. There you go. Uh, so, well, I mean, I could technically put the Vengeful in, but yeah, well, so after I lose it, political attack. when he, when he does break mill, I can put the Vengeful in if I but want. But you won't have a conflict left, so you don't do it. Oh, it doesn't get faded. You can't. Yeah. No. It's just one turn. It just puts into play. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Pass the conflict window. Yeah. There's really nothing for me to do here, but just to eat it at this point. Oh, go to T1 was here. Um, yep, yep. Just click the pass button, mash on pass. Um, you move in your brawler, or no, you move in the berserker with favorable ground when he attacks. Oh, just to not hit undefended? It, yeah, not get undefended, and you don't move in the brawler because if he is playing hand-to-hand, -hand, then he can hit one of your swords. Yeah, that would be you good. Don't want that, so. Fertile fields... Uh, he's definitely he's breaking, breaking, so we can he's got fertile. Ones, so. Um, 
for oh trees defenders right that fertile fields there's a greater glory again so next turn is gonna be nice yeah. all right yeah <clears throat> pulling the matsu pass no no okay so two. he gets favor and you just kind of have to hope he doesn't flip an uchiaki i think <laughs> Yeah, that card's overrated. Ujiaki. Oh, did he void me? He did. How did he? Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. So maybe playing for greater glory there wasn't great, but. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, it just gave him void value. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're, we're both. We've learned things. <laughs> okay. Let's do the next thing. Nick, are you there? Nick, are you there? Dear Nick. Yes. There you are. All right. Tactician's uh, Apprentice. Uh huh. So you just know who serve here, right? Yeah. <clears throat> well, you've only got. Yeah. I'm getting two fate out of it. That's not great. Really? Oh my that's interesting I mean I can play the other one but it's not no you can't it's limited ooh yep nice limited is the thing now huh you know what though that means he burned a voice on a thing that's not for greater glory that's true you can actually still just kind of go all in here yeah He's got like a fairly wide board, but neither of us are really defending. He just is gonna try and break first. Actually, at this rate, by the obstinate recruit. Uh, because it'll just yeah, <laughs> yeah. You don't. You kind of don't want that. Yeah, this is gonna uh, be okay. Okay. What? All right. I was gonna say put a fate on it. On this one. <laughs> yeah, because it'll encourage him to go void early. Hmm. Um, so if he goes like void first turn or first action, yeah, um, that's not not the worst thing in the world. Being five again, yes. All the obstinates are off. That's annoying, but the two of them are gone. So yeah, so okay. So he's sapping me oh, for an honor because of the tacticians apprentice apprentice. Actually, you know what? If he's on crane splash, there's a possibility. But he is on a running. Oh, uh, yeah, because with festivals. Uh, festivals, yeah. <laughs> nice. Okay. Is he that janky? Um, I, draw I don't phase. look. Oh, so I can waning here. If, uh, well, that's if you pass the draw phase, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, but I mean, do I want to? I think I do. I Let his board die off? and He's wider than me. That's I can... not a bad point. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, but you, then you need to break, and he's gonna have more resources to defend. Mm, I can bow one of them. Right. If he hasn't drawn a ready for battle in the last. Uh, How many cards? I'm gonna do Lots it. Of cards. I'm gonna do it. Waiting. I would be happy if these three left. Mm, he lets it go, but he had a choice. I don't like that about Jigoku. I know he's holding a cancel now, so he's got another voice. Nick, you cut out again, or you're very quiet. Mm. All right, so it's my, nice. my conflict. Uh, no, it's his. I don't do anything beforehand. No. You just kind of sit here and hope he goes water. Oh my god. Your Midnight Rebels is all. Is what? It's blank. Yeah. Yes, it is because of the LPB. That stinks. And he didn't find it. 
Unless he switches. I hate when they switch. I know, right? So you let him win this and play your eventual berserker in reaction. Yeah. So no defense. Uh, you, you know he can't stop you, so you can like rip out his for greater glories and stuff. Although he will get to trigger them before your uh, upholding goes off. So, or no, he won't. No, he won't. Yes, this is awesome. <clears throat> it would be good. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, so we pass. He left one at home. Yeah, because it's a courtier. Or a uh, political. Yeah, and zero, political. right. There's no, no point. Well, it has one for the... So he's going to try and pre-play something here, potentially. No. Nope. Uh, oh, I trigger this first. Yeah, right. I won, or I lost. So, vengeful. Then this. And what do we got? Voice, ready for battle, brace death, legion of ones. He doesn't have any. Nick, you're cut out again. Nick. Take the Paul rival. Huh. Oh, wait, no. He has one conflict this turn. Yep. Um... So Paul Rivals blank this turn, but on next turn right. and Voice gonna covert you out of box. Oh. Okay, so we take it. Yeah. Cause otherwise he just plays the Paul Rival with two fans, coverts out something and wins the game. Yeah. If he wants to voice Oh, but you know what, no? That was the wrong choice, damn it. I trusted you. I wrong. Yeah, because he's now gonna voice your um for greater, for greater glory. glory. Right. Maybe I can... I don't know. Okay, so you swing Earthring. Then you have a 1 in 15 <laughs> chance of hitting his... All right, I got it. I can do it. Boom. Boom. Uh, conflict phase pass. <clears throat> do, am I going all in? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, no reason. Definitely. Earth, mill, and... Um, LPB, I guess. Manicured. That's good. Cool. Yeah, avoiding shameful is always good. No defense. Pass. Do I like do something here to make him uh, LPB down his uh yeah. thing? Yeah, sure. Um we still have to decide whether he's readying for battle here. I can tactical okay. Why is he why up for glory? Okay. Yeah. Do I tactical ingenuity the scenario? Uh to get some... can, but she's gonna die. Yeah, but for cards. Yeah, yeah, but it's just a cycle then, right? Uh what? I would be able to Wait, what what card are you looking for? Another for greater glory. You can only it's a max one per conflict, so if it gets cancelled you're yeah. Wow. Okay. I mean, when it gets canceled. Yeah, it's gonna. So I don't. I just don't do it. Yeah. You know? Uh Oh, right. This happens before the, uh, the ring effect. Oh, God. Right, so I couldn't even hit it. I don't yeah, think I do it. No. no, I don't think you do. Yeah, he's just going to cancel it. Or do you need to draw out the cancel so you can yeah. serve next turn? Yeah. That's not gonna. That's not gonna win me the game. That's true. <clears throat> Do I go crazy on defense with another waning? Uh, certainly, because otherwise you're gonna die. Yeah, waning, defend, or no, attack, and then leave some kind of defense and hope I can survive. <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, this deck definitely fired better the first time through. I think that you are muted again, Nick. You really have to get a new mic. Um, regroup. The thing is, I don't think it's my mic. I think it's a connection issue of some mm. sort. Then you need a new connection. To Discord. I think I want the favorable. I don't know. 
Yeah, I'm going to take it. Why do you want the favorable? I don't know. In case he gets another pole rival or covert to me or something. Ooh. Uh, that could, this could win me the game. Maybe. Oh, yes, it could. <laughs> I mean, I'm not swinging with a whole lot. I'm going to buy it. Well, player those. No, no, hold on. Cancel. Oh, yeah, yeah. Those who serve first right. And make him cancel it. I have another. Oh, but I can't. No, nah, he has not. Okay, cool. So this, uh, no, no fate. One fate. I either lose here or not, right? So. Yeah, I think so. A, water ring is the only thing, and I'm going first. So. Yep. And even then, you have ready for battle. Death seeker. That's true. Um, remember your box when you're attacking. Yeah. And you're going to try to strengthen numbers home his uh, four threes. So. Okay. I don't have a commander. That's a little unfortunate. That's why I wanted to play it last time. Yeah. Shouldn't have saved this. <laughs> that was silly. Nope. Um, oh, but I need to actually have gas for the second conflict. <laughs> So you keep the Shinjo Ambusher and a Bonsai. All right. That's, yeah. But I got to, no, well, I have to play it like in the middle of the first conflict out of conflict, right? Uh, yes. Because I need to declare immediately. Yeah. Okay. Um, nothing to do first. Prepare for war. That does nothing. Yeah, it's just getting rid of shit. Strength the numbers, waning. Oh, waning, right? That's going to happen. No, I don't want waning. No. You don't want waning. All right, all right, okay. Yeah. I'm good. You're going all in. Uh, How did you play those who serve and still pass first? Wow. Did he, did he also play it? No. He just bought he it. He just had to buy everything. <clears throat> what do we get? Perfect cut. Perfect cut. Okay. You let me do it again. Yeah, so. He's only at 14 on it. Yeah, who cares? I don't care. Um, honor a resource you care about. Right. Why didn't, yeah. Um, I need the card. So, draw face pass. <clears throat> Yeah, card's good. Don't do this. Mm, conflict phase, don't do anything yet. Nope. Yeah, I think you're good for now. Everybody come along. Earth. Water. No, why water? To bow somebody? He is going to ready for battle, you. All right. <clears throat> Earth. Yep. Yeah. It's the best ring. It's real good. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, This one looks good. It's pilgrimage. Cool. It's blank. Yeah. Ooh. So... You want to... Okay, 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 okay. Here's what you do. You move home your uh, Berserker. This one? This one? Yes. Who can't participate in the next conflict to defend? No, your next one's going to be military. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Because you're you're going to break with the, with the other guy. Okay. And you need two guys in order to... Um, strength in numbers home his two glory people okay fair <clears throat> so you needed to move one home in order to do that yep uh, you have what bonsai way of the lion way of the lion is the same uh, you uh, try to LPB somebody right um, somebody outside the conflict so go hey yeah 
definitely. Uh, no, the four three. The four three. <clears throat> uh, the, sorry, the two one that's honored. The um, no, this one. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's going to ready for battle it, but it's okay. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Did that. Uh, um. I don't care about strength and numbers. I'm breaking right by, yeah. So I'm, oh no, I need to put my ambusher down. You don't, because you moved your guy home. Oh, that's true. Yep. Um, anything else to do here? I could honor somebody. Doesn't do anything for no. me. He, he still have voice on. Well, no, he wouldn't actually, because he's going to get prided. But that's okay. Ooh, that's interesting. Um, it's too late. Uh, do I want it for greater glory? Or something? <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, do, well, do you need the money? Is the only question. I got seven. What's the maximum one. No. On the rest of your no. Head, right? One, two, uh, three. One, two, three. No, I'm good. Okay, yeah, play it. I'm going to do it. Cancel it, because you're like, what? I cancel. I don't understand. I'll cancel. Yeah. Uh, cool. And wait. So uh, the iron, what's his face? Oh, it's, oh, it's Bushi's only. Yes. Okay. Earth ring, ornate fan, and I got another way of the lion. Trigger that guy. Yep. Okay. This is looking good. Two way of the lions. So here's how you're going to play this. Don't play the ambusher until the last minute. Okay. Mm -hmm. go, go in with the berserker, buff it to the sky, right? And then... Um, then play the ambusher because the ambusher sends home people with strength in numbers. So the goal is going to be to draw out all of his buffs onto one guy. And then and send that person home. Yep. Okay. Uh, so we do this. We... Uh, doesn't matter. Water. Yep. Water will give you a defender. Hmm? If you win the water ring, you'll get the defender. Oh, yeah. Play. Right, right, right. That makes sense. Okay. Smart, yep. smart, smart. Um, there we go. Dishonorable assault. Discard oh, that's perfect. one or more cards from your hand. Choose an equal number of attacking characters. Dishonor each of those characters. You're fine with this. Uh, it is a, what's my ambusher? There, one glory. Don't play it yet. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So he's got nine. So I bonsai. Start throwing bonsai, way of the lions. Yep. <clears throat> Basically every buff you can, and just hope he doesn't have assassinate. Basically. <laughs> so this is going to get voiced. Maybe he might save it for a later way of the lion when you're like plus sixing. Yeah. Okay. And then I think perfect cut. Yep, perfect cut twice. Because that so perfect cut will get you to winning. And he'll have to do something. Maybe. He's actually okay if you win but not break. That's true. Provided he has another ready for battle in hand. Because if you bow his venerable historian, then his so, turn's gone. Has he done anything yet? No. No, he just keeps passing. Yeah. So, oh, it's back on me. So I perfect cut again. Perfect. Yep. So you're going to perfect cut and... Then, um, way of lion. Yep. Did you pass again? No. Oh, do something. Not a commander. What did we get there? A fine katana. Okay, so that's interesting. You're okay with this? Yeah. Okay, so I weigh. Yep. If he has an assassination, that really just hoses me. <laughs> 
Yes, it does. He let it go. He let the first one go. Yeah, he'll he'll stop the second one because the second one is that's plastic. that's much more dangerous. Well, I mean, either you sharpen the mind. Okay, this is awesome. Play the second one. Uh, which oh, so this it's so it's on this thing. Yeah, because he's stacking all his buffs on that. Yeah, one guy. right. And you can just if he lets it through. Nah. Okay, I told you. Yeah. Yeah. So now I can drop the Shinjo in. Yep. And then he's going to go, oh, crap. Maybe. No additional fate. Well, he's got Legion of Ones. Oh, but he can't. He can't. Ah. Exactly. Um, you can't use the ability. Nice. Yep. Hmm. <clears throat> And actually, this is strength of numbers is more dangerous than the second way of the line. Right. So the fact that he canceled that is a mistake. Coming. Well, he might have another, but I have a second one of these. Exactly. You, you have a second one, and your guy is already huge, and you have challenge on the fields. Like, you he actually has Oof. maybe did something in the challenge. He's got to do something now. Yep. Good game. Yeah. He's going to play uh, Way of the Lions on the Gohei. Yeah. You're going to send him. I mean, whichever one he does, I send the other one, that one home, like immediately. So, what you do next is you try to bait out the voice. So, if he Way of the Lions Gohei, you challenge on the fields him. Yeah. Right? Because. Right, that's smarter. Figures, if he can get the next Way of the Lions. Zentaro. Then he's closer. Zentaro, because he wants a... Hmm? What? Zentaro at home? I'm confused. Was that intentional? <clears throat> okay. Don't get it. Fine. Nor do I. Do I send this home? Um, no. No, I, I'm winning. No. <clears throat> what is this what's that all about oh uh, that's why oh got it now you send him home yeah well, no. you wait you wait until he plays enough cards that you are no longer or well now now he's a six so i do that oh uh what is what it'll be a nine oh. to your 14 so you're still winning with a challenge right so you do challenge on the fields uh, and i choose, choose the berserker yeah All the send homes. So he either uses his third voice right now, or he dies, and then he dies to your strengths and numbers. Do I even need a bid in here? Nope. If I bid one and he bids five, it's doesn't fit. It doesn't. Oh, I win. Yep. <clears throat> Good game. Unless he has a conflict character and can pump the shit out of that. Cool. Even if he does, you strengthen numbers at home. So that was fun. Oh, uh, Fred embraced death. He was gonna murder somebody. Yeah, right. On defense. Okay. <laughs> that card's fun. Yeah, it is. Cool. All right, so line's fun. Uh, gonna kill your left over your guy after your attack. Yeah, if he could. Isn't it? Leftover guy. Participating. I wouldn't leftover guy. I'm not sure about what that, uh, that was. You try to kill your um, your berserker that you had sent home, so you couldn't start your next. Oh, before. Okay, cool. Well, um, I guess with the interest of deck doctoring, before I, I think we'll end this video after this. But first, is there what, what do we want to tweak? Uh, let me pull up this uh, this list here on my screen so I can. I guess let me. So I, I did. Let's go to my actual account because I can I can edit it there. Uh, deck box. Oh, I thought I cloned it. I guess not. Let's try that again. Back, back, and clone. Um, 
Sure, I guess let's share this deck so that people can see what we do. And here we go, Swarm Murder, and we will, oh, info, right? Um, Change it to, uh, yeah, Deck Doctor or something. Meek. Swarm Murder Deck Doctor. Deck Doctoring. Okay. So, thoughts. You don't like, you don't like the role. Yeah, I, well, what I'm wondering is it, if so earth obviously makes up holding worse um but it would get you um the stand card uh, unfulfilled duty mm, that sounds good yeah. well but it does but you don't have a way to generate additional military conflicts except for the unicorn except for the unicorn the Ivory Kingdoms unicorn. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Like if you attack, win, break, come home, stand all your guys. Great. You have how much political? All right. So, is it crazy to try HMT then? It's not crazy. Um, I think you would need to change the conflict deck a bit. Like I think you probably at that point would drop. Like you'd go to three perfect cuts for sure. Because you need all the buffs you can get if you need to win by five plus, right? Right, that is a lot. Yeah, I. I... All right, so nah, nah to that. Yeah, I'd say so. I'd say nah. Okay, so we're gonna keep that. Um... Oh God, we forgot to bow the stronghold on the attack. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> That's a third third line game for you. Um, yep. So seeker of earth. Yeah, but uh, what are your other Earth provinces? They're all like bad. Well, let's okay. So let's experiment here. Uh, excuse me. Secret of Earth. Set the roll. I don't like bad. Bad upholding is bad. Um, we keep we get rid of midnight, right? No, you get rid of Art of War. Really? Okay. I mean, you, you're already running the tiny bodies, right? Yeah. So Earth, what do we got? No. Well, maybe. That's maybe. Ancestral. Yeah, I don't know. Unlike on the box. Yeah, but that means one of your seeker provinces is on the box. No, yeah, yeah, that's true. Uh, oh, there you go, Guardians of Saikitsu. Yeah, you can bow all your uh, little people. Each game. this is the opposite of what this card this deck wants. Yep. Uh Vassal. Yeah, there's nothing else that's good. Yeah. I mean technically public forum if you never expect to go yeah. against Unicorn. Oh yeah. Or anyone with the stupid um ambusher, which is like lots of people. So Desolation. Desolation does it too. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so if it's not Seeker of Earth, then what is it? Right. So the only thing you would be going Seeker of Earth for is Unfulfilled Duty. Which, yeah. Okay. It might be Seeker of Water. Okay. Right, Brandon might know what he's talking about. So far, not changing anything. I know. Um, so the Embrace Death is cute. I don't know if it's good. I mean, you have the people to sacrifice. It is 1x. It, it, it's fun. If they get in your way. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel about the wanings? I'm iffy on the wanings. I mean, they did kind of save your life last game, so they're not bad. They did. What, are we, what else would we want in its place, I guess? Yeah, what are lion cards? What are line card Legion of One? No, never gonna happen. Nope. Um, Blade of Ten Thousand Battles. You know what you're missing. Now that's another stand, and you don't actually care about stands. Um, I kind of do, I guess. If I want, you know, swing a political every once in a while. Okay, so the other option is Elegant Tessin. What? Uh, came out in the Dragon Pack. 
Okay, it's not up on uh, Jagoku. Oh, well then let's not consider that. Okay, fine. Damn. So, that's not bad. Kind of. I don't know. Well, so, it only unbows in the middle of a conflict. Oh. Somebody who's in the conflict. Okay, never going to hit Heroic Resolve, Rings... Yeah, honor and battle could, if people stick around, could be okay. If they stick around, yeah. Yeah. It's better, like, that might be better than Glory's Victory, maybe? I put one in there. I mean, if. Glory's Victory is there to keep you from, like, dying the Scorpion. Right. Um, what about this dude? No, I'll never have the money, right? Well. I mean, you might, though, right? That last turn, you had, like, seven money going into your last attack. To help stall things, maybe? I'm going to put one of him in there for a second. Yeah. Um, in, in service to my lord. I don't know what that does. Uh, bow a non-unique, stand a unique. Bow a non-unique, stand a unique. Hmm. That's not really that great. From your discard pile. After you catch a trigger's ability, bow it. Mm, nope. Okay. Yeah. I'm starting to see why some of these deck choices were made. Because, <laughs> like, lion cards are definitely cards. But... I don't have, I don't have courtiers. Um, can we fit a coma reservist in here? Yeah, I thought about that. Um, what about this? So Mike was playing that, but Mike's doing a more balanced deck. Yeah. He cares more about the political buff. But like but I could there. break on political occasionally with one card, right? I mean. Right. And well, two cards, but yeah. Yeah. And know. like I wonder if you need to balance this out a bit more. Like that that is actually kind of the thing I'm thinking is that right now you've got like one way to generate political numbers and it's yeah. almost so like it's like her and like honor general is your next biggest because he got he has three it's not great you know okay so i threw in anakazu a reservist and an honor in battle and a sharpen in mind sharpen the mind those are the like candidate cards i think for this tweak so we're gonna reduce waning to one. I don't know. No, you glorious. So if you're, yeah, glorious victory goes. Yeah, it's gone. If you're looking to, um, like lean into a more balanced approach, I think you cut waning altogether. Okay. Um. So what am I gonna? Do? All right. So let's try that. How do we get political something happening here? I still have 41 cards. Sharpens. Yeah. Or, well, I guess, do you play Sharpen the Mind or do you just play the vastly more efficient Ornate Fan? Sure. Ornate Fan. Seems better. Three. Now we're at 43 cards. Hmm. Yep. And we haven't even started touching the conflict side yet. We ditched the Embrace Death. Um... We ditched the honor in battle. No, maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it does. For like me. if you leave somebody at home, mill, win, honor, and then break on political because they're honored. So it's a little more political skill. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. That seems a little weak. Um, we do have the ornate fans. What's the reservist going to get us if you've claimed the fire or water? I'm largely want to go... Cost one, one that gets hit by favorable, or uh, for greater glory. That's true. It's a Bushi as well. Yeah, right. So that's... Okay. Um, and Anakazu. Anakazu, I'm questioning. I feel like we'd have to play some games and see... So, like, he's basically the same idea as a vengeful Oathkeeper, but he costs a lot of money. Right. Um... Any changes on the dynasty side quickly? 
Uh, so the one that I would look at is the Matsu Swift Spear. Really? Um, yeah, I, I, so it is very efficient if you have fewer cards in hand, but I mean, two for two, two, you have Bushi. all this draw built in, right? Fertile fields, art of war, right? Tactical ingenuity. Like you're going to have to not use those things in order to have fewer cards in hand. All right. So what is the paying two for a two two? It's not great. What is the replacement? So the replacement has to be something with blue numbers, right? Right. Kage. That's what we're adding. Yes, it's a Kodo. What? Kage. What about her? I mean, she's expensive. She's expensive. She's a Shugenja, so she gets bowed by um, mm. Phoenix. Um, and there's one other reason not to run her. Oh, you're not running charge. Right. So her effect is a lot worse. Okay. Well, suggestions. Uh, is it, is yeah, it, I'm looking up. is it just, um, the big guy? Oh, the favor guy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's boring. Extremely boring. Ah, tireless, tireless, so, so then Senzo. Kitsumoto. Mm, yeah. That's actually in my paper version of the deck. He's a commander. He's a 3 3. Right. So he's nice and balanced. Yep. Two glory. Done. You can pull people in. Yep. Uh, in and, and he, uh, he uh, yeah, the tactical ingenuity that oh, we're for. There's only two of these. Yeah. Yeah. In the deck. So, what's the third character I pull out? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, Death Seeker, I would think. One Death Seeker. All right. I'm gonna save this. The curve goes up a bit. But... Yeah, it's a bit. Uh, but just a tiny bit. Yeah. I mean, you basically added net what two fate, three fate to the the dynasty deck. I think that's okay. I think. Right. All right. So, I'm gonna save that. Um, we'll give this another shot maybe in the next couple days, put another video up and see how it goes. Cool. cool. Sounds good. Thanks, Nick. This was yeah, fun. Was good time. See you later. All right, bye.